and wide, but that was over a week ago. What do you mean? Gordon and I were just there a minute ago. Fascinating. We seem to have developed a very slow teleport. This suggests an entirely new line of investigation. A week? Then what is the new A great deal, my dear. The blow. Okay, so this is the new clip that I came up with for City 1701 and you need 160 ish half is enough, 175 is better obviously you don't need what I just have, what I now have. There is a method to do this with less, I will try to cover this but I have not done a lot of research into that one. Anyway, as soon as it starts, you come out here, take the monitor, come over here, and I like to jump from this angle, because as you can see, this, this jump is really weird, because you can't stand on this. So, I come right from here and you just jump into it, this happens, and you can get it up easily. So, from here on, you want to clip on this edge. And we have to pay attention to that because if we clip here, we have to adjust the setup a tiny bit. If we clip here, we also have to adjust it a tiny bit. But it's not too difficult as long as you stay around this place. So, do a monitor clip, which still is really dumb, but no way around this. It's not any worse than the other one. Pretty much the same. Come on. Okay. So, I'm a tiny bit to the left of this now. There are probably uh, position values that you can start learning. I haven't looked at those yet. I just go by visual stuff. So we have to adjust maybe a tiny bit, probably we don't even have to adjust, this is not that, that far away from it. So then you turn around and you see this like white kind of claw mark thing, whatever it is. And this spike, the left one, the long one. This is the setup for when you are right on this and probably where I am now. So, you want to aim exactly onto the peak of it. If I'm more to the left, I have to adjust to that. And I want to aim to this side. Don't zoom in for that. Uh, I like to use the dots on my crosshair to adjust. Because it's not that precise, honestly. But it does need some adjustments. So, I line the left crosshair up with this thing. If I'm on the other side, and the right crosshair dot up with the thing. But whatever, let's try the spot on, because I'm really close to the center, so it will work. So, shoot both rockets right into that. Once again, there's a setup that uses a rocket and one SMG nade, with, which takes less health, has less speed, and therefore needs a different setup, but I... I'll try to cover this shortly afterwards. And then you just save load 27 times at full speed. Perfect. You don't have to, but you can, because uh, you will enter the void after a few save loads here for about three save loads, and then you enter normal space again, where you can just normally save load. So there's no real point in going slow, actually. You can also not adjust this at all so just do it 27 times so that, that your timer is not moving and if you didn't get it you didn't even lose time for that so 
minus the two rockets. So, you can see, I slowly crouch up, like, crawl up this wall because I can't pass this. I need to be beneath it, which is fine, which is exactly what we want because we can't go this way. Then we would get stuck in the void. And you can kind of see if you go along this line from this little metal piece. And you kind of know if it's correct. And you can see if you pass this wall and you can't see it at all anymore, then you're also too far. This should be about 14 save loads. I didn't time, no, uh, didn't count now. So now the next one should put me into the void. There. And I can still see this side of the wall. So this time it worked. From here on, I just do my three void clips. I missed one. I missed one again. And you see, I regain my speed because I re entered some uh, clip rush from above. Which normally isn't possible, but in this case, we can transfer from above into it and. We still have our momentum this way and this way, but we can't go this way because there's, like, we're touching this. Like, apparently it's a different brush or something. Uh, you can't enter this for some reason. So we save load, puts us down, and now we should start going forwards again. The next one. There. Now we're going forwards again. And now it will push us into the wall, and the next one will boost us with all our velocity into the rocks and up into the trigger. And here we are on 7702. That's pretty much it. Now I mentioned a backup. If you have less HP, you can try going for the rocket in the SMG net. I have not played around with this much, like I don't know how to adjust this, it when I'm in different places but I pretty much aim at this little egg-shaped mark on the wall it's like diagonally above the normal setup at the top of it I shoot my rocket I switch to my SMG and shoot my SMG as you see I have more speed uh, I have more HP but I have less speed so this also looks a bit different if it works it looks kind of weird so let's see if i got it once again i have not played around much with this version so this might not work if it works it will push me in a really weird spot now and yeah see it didn't work so i guess maybe we have to adjust it more than the other one so let's try that so i'm on the left side try this once again, I'm using my crosshair to line up. I'm not a fan of positional values. Because they are slow. It looks much better. This will work. Yeah, and it pushes me forward again. I can do my void clips if I don't miss them. Into the brush from here on right into the load sometimes very rarely it, it happened once to me you do not get boosted up or you get caught in here if that happens you should have enough hp for a grenade boost with this spread with the two rockets i'm not certain it depends on how much hp you enter the map with but yeah, this whole thing, not with the setup, is also possible with just one rocket, which will not get you up into the trigger, but you have a ton more HP, so you can obviously just grenade boost into it. So again, you don't have to do it slow like I just did. You can just go full speed if you're confident in your void clips, and it takes about 27, it just, just to 28 for safety's sake save loads to get right into the load from the clip.